Remind us of the first step. In all around the world. Great. I mean, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Cecilia, you get to decide what that means, how much you want to read, one sentence, two sentences, three sentences. Go ahead, sweetheart, and read all around the word muffling. And if Jamie's old earmuffs happened to make an outstanding muffling device, was it that funny if he liked to wear them? Okay, great. Does anybody want to read any more, or does, do we think that that covers it? Jack, what are you thinking? Okay, great. Let's go ahead here. Number two. Uh, Lily, go ahead and read it. Figure out the feeling of the word. Okay. And sometimes we can do this, sometimes we can't. But you kind of think, oh, does this feel really positive? Is this a positive moment? Ooh, is this a negative? Or kind of neither one. It's just a bit neutral. And so here's how we'll do this. When you hear the word muffling, I'm going to ask you just a second if you think it's positive, if you think it's negative, or actually it's just kind of neutral. Okay? Go ahead and show me. Okay, so we think it might be a positive word. Okay, so we'll go with that for now. And if we have to revise it later, we can do that. Now, uh, Jack, number three. Try to replace it with a word or words that make sense. Okay, so we have to go back in here. And as you look in here, in your mind, you try and replace the word muffling. It can be with one word. It can be with a lot of different words. Okay. Cecilia, read us the context again. Read us what you read. And if Jeannie's old earmuff happen, earmuffs happened to make an outstanding muffling device, was it funny that he liked to wear them? Okay. Think about what you think muffling could mean. Okay, let me know when you have an idea. Okay, one idea is, two ideas. Jack raised his hand. Okay, cool. Um, let's try, you guys all know how to use the chat box? Yeah. Okay, so go ahead into the chat box. Okay, don't hit enter yet. But just put what you think muffling might mean, okay? No enter yet. We're going to enter at the same time. So, Jack, while you write your idea, I'm going to ask Lily a question. I think this might help Cecilia. Um, Lily, I think there's like a little bit more context or a little bit more we could read to yes. understand this word. Okay. Uh, Lily, read what you think. Add the context or the sentences that's gonna, that, that will help us. That sensitive, sensitive hearing, for one, he didn't like loud sounds. What was so unusual about that? Good. And then go ahead and keep reading what Cecilia read. And if Janie's old earmuffs happened to make an outstanding muffling device, well, was it that funny if he liked to wear them? Great. So what Lily just did... Um, is that she added on to number one, where we read all around the word or we use, um, we, we get the context. So Cecilia gave us good context and then Lily gave us more context. Um, we think it's a positive word so far and now we're trying to replace it. Okay, so if you are ready, go ahead and hit enter, please. Okay, chat. Okay, we'll go down here, okay. Good. So, can you guys see my chat box? Or can you see your own chat box? Uh, yeah. Okay, great. So, um, great. So, one idea of Cecilia's is it's, it means, and I like this because you don't have to have a perfect definition. She says, you know, something about, means something close to, and then I'll put this, quiet. So, Cecilia's like, it means something about quiet. It might mean to block out noise. And then I'm just gonna put it like this, block out noise. And that's a different idea. Okay, and then now it something, something close to, awesome. Okay, 
So I'll do that in a different one. Do that in blue. Okay, fantastic. So now what we do is we do this. We replace it. We go ahead and replace it with these things and we see what makes sense. So here we go. And if Janie's old earmuffs happen to make an outstanding, and then I'm gonna use this first one, quieting device, what was so funny to wear them, okay? Let's try the next one. And if Janie's old earmuffs happen to make an outstanding uh, device that blocked out noise, was it funny if he liked to wear them, okay? And the last one is, and if Janie's old earmuffs happened to make an outstanding, awesome device, was it that funny if he liked to wear them? Okay. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to tell me which ones you think makes the, you know, are cl the closest and which ones you think maybe aren't. Okay. Looking at the context. So, Jack, let me start with you. What do you think about these three? You think quiet makes the most sense? Okay. Um, so Jack, um, Jack thinks this one. Any others or just quiet? Just quiet? Jack. Talking to you. Uh, Jack, can you? <laughs> I said, you don't have to pick just one. Do you want to pick just one or any others make sense? That's the one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Cecilia, which ones do you think make the most sense? Block out noise. Block out noise. Okay. Cecilia. Okay. Lily, what do you think? And oh, sorry, Cecilia, just that one or another one too? Uh, just that one. Okay. And then Lily, what are you thinking? I kind of think quiet and block out noise. Okay. Great. Lily. Really? Good. Okay, cool. So we'll go take that one out. Great idea. And then